What's up, y'all? This is another Cody D vlog, and this is gonna be a crazy one. <laughs> I'm with my homeboy Gamer. What is going on, bro? <laughs> Man, and what's up, world? It's your boy Gamers twenty four three sixty, man. And you know, if you, I might post this on my channel. If you watch this on my channel, here to watch my boy Cody D, man. He's he's a good friend of mine, and he got some good videos on his channel. He just needs a little bit more exposure. So go ahead and hit that boy out with a subscribe or a view or something, man. His link will be in the description area below. If you watch this on my channel. Um, we got a serious topic, man, because, um, uh, yes, I you do. Yes, you do. I appreciate getting, the shout-out. It's getting a little bit out of hand. <laughs> it's getting a little bit out of hand, bro. Um, these skinny jeans. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I say, these skinny jeans. Yes, yeah, yeah, skin, yeah, skinny jeans been out of, and way out of hand, like, a long time ago, ever since. And, 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 like, skinny jeans, like, skinny jeans was, you know... Not trying to put a race car, but a white person thing. You feel what I'm saying? But black people picked it up, and it, it's not looking good. It, it 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 it's worse when they try to sag it. It's already bad enough we sag. Well, pe some people sag their pants and show their drawers anyway. But they're doing it with skinny jeans. Now I read this comment. I read this comment that you posted up on Facebook prior to this taping. About men wearing leggings? Yes, I just, I just seen it all. Like I was, I was on the road or whatever, and I was picking up a, a couple of stuff for um, um for my child's on um, Valentine's Day. And to everybody watching this on on Valentine's Day, Happy Valentine's Day! But um, I seen a couple of young people, and I'm not I'm not old. Don't get me wrong, but I'm older. I'm I'm over 25, but I'm under 30. You do the math on that one. But I seen them wearing skinny jeans, and I pulled up on the side of them, and I was like, you know, because I always wanted to wonder how do it feel. I mean, I always wanted to know how do it feel to wear skinny jeans? Don't you? Don't your balls have? To breathe or something? Are you are you scared you're gonna get a yeast infection or something? But no, these dudes are not even wearing skinny jeans. These just like leggings. These things was like thin, like bro, like it's, it's kind of cold outside from down where I'm in, and they're wearing leggings. I'm like, bro, aren't you aren't you scared you're gonna get a yeast infection? Like, is that comfortable to you? Yeah, man, it's swag, man. Where I come from, my damn town. If you come to school. With tight shirts, or tight pants, or pink shoes, or or, or dye your hair, you gonna come home with hurt feelings, or you gonna get into a fight or something because that wasn't in at my time. And what makes it worse is these people wearing skinny jeans and they're sagging, like and with a belt, like you you letting everybody know, yeah, I got a belt on, but I'm sagging. You see my my leopard boxes, they're made of silk, dude. That is so feminine to me, bro. Like that <laughs> suspect is just... hell. Like, and 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 and, and, don't, and don't get me wrong. I'm not the type of person that you know that that's against gays or anything like that. Like, let them do them. You know what I'm saying? But if you are a straight guy and you're doing this, something is very wrong here. <laughs> like you are. Like like I said. Oh. Mm. Like, like I said, man, it's, it's, it's 2014. Everybody, everybody that's gay is coming out the closet. Just come out the closet if you're gay. I have nothing wrong with gay people. You know, what you do is what you do. What you eat don't make me shit. Um, excuse my English, French, whatever you want to call it. I don't know why they say excuse my French because it's made of English. But that's another <laughs> topic right there. But um, <laughs> I'm just saying, though, um, like, seriously, if you're gay... Be gay. If not, open your eyes and see what's what's going on around you. Next, people are going to be wearing skirts and stuff and high heel forces. Oh, this is swag, dude! You look just like a chick. It's, it makes no sense. Where you know, cowboy, you know, Wranglers, and cowboy pants they're looser than skinny jeans. Skinny jeans are showing your male figure. Like that's not cool. And like I say, I don't have nothing wrong with gay people. I don't have nothing against them because the simple fact that. What you do is what you do. I have nothing against that. You know, you're going to do what you got to want to do regardless. You know, um, 
You can be gay all you want. Just don't bring it to me. I mean, I have gay friends. As long as they don't bring it to me, I'm cool. I'm an ace, boom, cool, whatever. You know what I'm saying? I'm the coolest dude you could ever get to meet. But it, it's, it's, it's that time now that people have to open their eyes and see what's going on around them. Because if you don't, you're just going to be looking like a, a crash dump. You're going to look straight like a, 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 a stupid fool. Right. You know, and people, I mean, I sag, don't get me wrong. And my, my sag is like the mid sag. It's go over my hip. You might see my butt crack, but I wear a big shirt. So you won't get to see, um, you won't really get to see my draws. Now, it kills me that these dudes wear these skin tight shirts. It's like, you know what I'm saying? Your vein gonna pop out and stuff. And, and you see the whole asses. Like they're, they're sagging their pants to their kneecaps. Like, really, bro? Hell no. I know, no. Cody. Hell no. I can't. I cannot. I'm just no. <laughs> like, and see, <laughs> and see, and this is my thing. And 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 not not trying to make this video long, but people gotta realize, like, the sagging thing. Period. Like the sagging thing. It it it, it comes from the prisons. You feel me? That is like. The, the, the international call sign of I want to get my ass straight. Feel me? <laughs> so, like, apparently people are still not getting the message. And then you're gonna and, the, and, and then fast forward you're gonna do this thing like leggings. Come on, people. Like, like, like. I, I don't know what, the, I don't know what to say about that. You ever heard of uh, Ace Jeff Rocky, right? When he was wearing that uh, that long shirt that looked like a dress. Yeah, I seen the pictures for that. Swag. Yeah, that fat, you see what I'm saying? It's more and more. <coughs> it's more and more. I'm not even gonna mm. say gay. I'm gonna say um, not a straight fat. You know, it went from metrosexual to this now. You know, but I can't believe it too much because when I was growing up, you know, um, a lot of older people were saying that. It was gay for me to wear two earrings in my ear. And, you know, that was the fashion at the time, during the uh, fabulous era when he had them huge earrings the size of your size of little baby heads on his ear and stuff. And I was rocking that. People were saying that I was gay for that. But, uh, you know, I, I said, fuck it, I still rock I still rock it anyway because that's what I wanted to wear. I can't really just tell these young people that because, you know, because I did something that older people older than me called gay. And now I'm looking at these people like, you got nipple boxes on. You wearing the same thing this female is wearing. You wearing pink. You're gay. And they're going to be like, you just don't understand. You're too old. Like, and I'm not old, but still, they're going to be like, you don't understand. You don't have swag. And that's the same way I was when I was their age. I was like, you don't understand. You ain't hip to the game, bro. I got earrings. They, they cost more than your car. You know, but <laughs> that's what it is. The time change, the time get different. You know, I'm just, I'm just being honest, like seriously. But um, I wish LG was here. What, what is LG? I, yeah, I would, I, would, I wish he, I wish he was here too. Because believe me, if he was in this conversation, well, he, he he'd be all over this topic, <laughs> like white on rice. Believe me. <laughs> and and, sh and shout out to LG by the way. Like go to go to his channel too, Lawrence 2008 1987. That dude would be on this topic like white on rice if he was here, but. Unfortunately, he's nowhere to be found right now. <laughs> but hey, we might have to make a part two. <laughs> we might have to make a part. We two. might. Who knows? I don't know. Uh, but, 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 I, mean, I, I kid you not. The next step that, the next step they're gonna do is wear kilts and college swag watches. It's not gonna be. <laughs> you, hey, 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 you know what? Hey, 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 you know, and hey, you know what? Kilts are only good if you wear them in Scotland, if you are Scottish born. <laughs> so imagine, so imagine an American wearing one. Oh, oh, oh no! I will go off like as soon as I see this, I will go off. And people, hmm. people like, um, a lot of people went off on R. Kelly too for trying to do that. You trying to rock skinny jeans? This man is almost forty and rocking skinny jeans. That is uncool, bro. Yeah, man, wear leather pants and, and leather shirts. And you, you are out of there, man. You're too old for that. I, okay, I, I'm cool with you know, someone under the age of 18 
maybe even 21, walking skinny jeans and doing all this stuff. Cause that's what they're, that's what they growing up on. You know what I'm saying? That's their fashion. But hmm. if you're over that, nigga, you gay. I'm, I'm sorry, you gay. You can't come, you can't come out of there. Yeah. I'm just gay or at least gay or at least bi or something. I mean, cause that's that's just no. you, you just don't do that. <laughs> that there's there's so something. Where, that, where did this leopard pet from? Um, where did this leopard um stuff come from? You, you see a lot of these people wearing like leopard snapbacks and leopard shirts. I thought leopard was a female thing. I never seen. Like, I, I thought I thought leopard. it I thought it was too. Make, I thought it was too. Maybe, maybe, maybe people know something that I don't know, or we don't know in this case. <laughs> but swag, I guess swag. My my thing my thing is my thing is this: if you're gonna wear something taboo like that, it be, it better be in the bedroom, and that's it. I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah. But if I catch you out, don't. <laughs> I t I tell I tell you. I'm, I'm gonna hurt feelings. I'm gonna be honest. I tell I tell you I tell you what though you actually turning around and asking that dude that <laughs> that was like that'll be that'll, that'll be something I would do. Like, like seriously, I had to I had to address the fact because I'm like yo, this nigga had he had the whole booty out like seriously. Like, who does that? Like, he's showing off every shape of his butt. And he wasn't even wearing, like, boxer boxers, like the loose boxers. This was, he was wearing, like, the boxer briefs. And the whole point about it, I wasn't trying to, like, actually look, but it just, it just stunned me because I seen it. I was like, the fuck? What the fuck is going on? He, he's showing his whole booty, but he has a belt on. His belt is under his butt cup. Like, who does that? And I felt very, I felt very violated, you know what I'm saying? I felt very homo doing this, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I have no problem with gay people, but still, I don't want to see that. You know what I'm saying? At least, at least wear you a, a, a long enough shirt or something. This dude's shirt was like, up here, like, kind of like a tank top kind of, sort of. You know, I'm like, bro, if yeah. I can see the top of your boxes and the bottom of your boxes, you need to go home and... and Redo your own wardrobe, like seriously. For some, or rethink your wardrobe. Ask yourself, why did I buy this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, if I if I was one of the, I don't, I don't know, man. if if I was one, if I was one of those secret millionaires or whatever, I would redo his whole wardrobe. Be like, hey, look, bro. Okay, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a secret, I'm a secret millionaire. Another thing. Another thing. <laughs> Thing. Wait, I don't mean to cut you off. I don't mean to cut you off. Oh, you good? You heard of that Nene dance? That's gay. Yeah, that is gay. I'll tell you, it's a, it's a gay agenda in America. Like, man, everything people are coming out with nowadays is gay. Nene, when I heard it, I was like, man, that's a gay dance. It gotta be. I looked at it, these niggas arching their back. And what does what look like? I'm. Hey, yeah. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 bro. That's, that, the explanation I got on that. That's what the, the, the explanation I got on that was the the people who created the dance. They saw a crack. They saw a crackhead doing that same dance, and they decided to name it after n n name it after a female called Nene. So they did that exact same dance and tried to make it into a dance or whatnot. And I tried to address. I tried to address the same thing you're doing. Oh, that's gay, but people are like, no, that's a certain way of, that's a certain way a man do it, and it ain't gay. I'm like, the way that you don't like the way you do it. No, that there ain't no other way. See, 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 see. I, I've ran across people saying that, and I'm like, bro, I tell them to demonstrate for me. Because, honestly, I'm not even going to lie. I'm not going to sit here in front, you know what I'm saying, and people see me and be like, oh, he's gay. No. Because, um, like, in the club, a lot of people have fun doing it. And I go to clubs, you know, every every now and again or whatever, and I like to have fun. But the way I do it and the way these people are doing it is, is, is out, of, out of the line. People laugh at me because they're like, you're doing it wrong. I'm like, really? The only people that do the name, they do 
X Link is gay people and girls. Only ones. If you straight, you just look gay. You know what I'm saying? These, hey, me, I, hey, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing this. I'm just rocking my shoulders. I'm, hey, you know what I'm saying? I'll probably do something silly of, hey, that's it. These people, like they put makeup on and vulgar and stuff. And, like, do you arching your back, your ass is hanging out and your ass is poked out? Dude, you, next thing you're going to want, to want somebody to do is walk up behind you and get rolled up or something. Oh, like, God. <laughs> Like, that's something I cannot accept. <laughs> My best friend, like, hmm. uh, but, um, dang, how long is this video? <laughs> I don't know. Probably over our limit, but yeah. We, but yeah, we just had to get that out there, y'all. <laughs> yeah. they, they may be a part two, de depend, depending, depending on the availability of LG. <laughs> I know when LG hears this. Gonna to want to do a point two too. Oh man! <laughs> and I know we probably get a lot of hate for this because a lot of people are not even gonna hear of the fact what we're saying. <laughs> All right, man. But but yeah, it's, it's a lot of people that's not gonna understand what we're saying, man. Um, like we said, we didn't, we don't have anything against gay people. It's just nothing against gay people. But if you're straight. And you're doing this stuff, you gotta open your eyes because you're looking very suspect around us. Right. And, you know, um, if you're gay, just come out the closet, just be gay. If you're bisexual, a famous YouTuber, um, what's his name? Um, this is a commentary. Yeah, he Trey Melvin, he came um, out. Yeah, and I'm still subscribed to him. I'm not gonna stop subscribing to someone just because they're gay. You know what I'm saying? Just because they're bi. I'm not gonna stop being someone's friend because they're gay, because they're bi. If someone stop being your friend because you're gay or you're bi, or whatever your preference. There's not your friend to begin with. You know what I'm saying? They gotta accept you for being you. So, just watch what you're doing because um, a lot of us people nowadays we're puppets. You know what I'm saying? And we don't know what we're doing until it's too late. You know what I'm saying? Because next, the next step is, and mark my words, people are gonna be wearing kilts or skirts dresses and they're going to be called the fashion you might wear pants under that dress or that kilt but it's still a dress and watch most my words people are going to be like this is not gay then they already did this on the boondocks already they already showed you guys what's happening right mm -hmm. now you know what I'm saying? you're going to be wearing a purse nah, it's a man bag a man you know, bag in front of it don't mean nothing you know it's a purse just just watch just watch america shit is getting real Pause. <laughs> Pause again, granddad. <laughs> Pause again, granddad. <laughs> yeah, tell these, tell these people for tell these people for the sake of my channel where they can find you at again and all that jazz. <laughs> uh, I have a lot of channels, and I'm just gonna about one. Um, I have a lot of channels, and I'm just gonna give about one. Um, if you if you're here for the vlogs and stuff, and and the craziest stuff that open your eyes, make you laugh, and probably make you cry a little bit. Go to Gamer Seventy Four Three Sixty HD, and you, you, I hope you'll enjoy your view. I mean, you you stay there, and if um, you want another dose, I just started another channel um, called Gamer Seventy Four Three Sixty News, and that will be like extra news, like something that you would not catch anywhere, you know what I'm saying? Like the unheard of news. So uh, thank you all for your time here. Um, thank you, Cody. It's, it's been an honor yeah, to that's... actually finally be in a video with you. Like finally. Yeah, I know, right? It's been too long of a wait, but we finally be able to do it. <laughs> but yeah, we got... Oh, <laughs> but yeah, we gotta get out of here. <laughs> you stupid. <laughs> we gotta get out of here. Hopefully, there'll be a part two to this, maybe. But for now, this is Coley D. Peace. Chicken grease. <laughs>